in this uh, podcast. We definitely have quite a lot to talk about. We've got great news coming in. Hello, everyone, and thank you for being part of the Arsenal chapter. And make up and subscribe and ring that notification bell so you do not miss out on whatever we've definitely got to bring to you as long as this pods and as long as it is Arsenal related, right up here at the Arsenal chapter with me, your host Abu Kaus, as definitely am definitely dedicated to bring to you the latest straight as it comes in. It will be remembered that the club West Ham has definitely tried to make things complicated a bit for the club Arsenal to get uh, the football player. It will be remembered uh, that Declan Rice is valued at 120 million pounds and right about now Arsenal has had a th- uh, two bids rejected and the third bid is in. It will be remembered the first bid was 80 million pounds and the second bid was 90 million pounds and all of those were rejected and right about now Arsenal has a bid of 100 and 105 million pounds with 100 fixed a million 100 million fixed and then a five a million pound on for add-ons and definitely performance add-ons are those that definitely are being valued at five million pound and right about now what some comes up and says they can easily take 100 million and plus a football player and it is reportedly said that there could be a po- there could be uh, a possibility of Arsenal getting back to terms with uh, uh, a revised bid and uh, we're trying to see how can it uh, get revised because uh, whom should uh, Arsenal give to uh, the, uh, whom should Arsenal give to West Ham because West Ham has said they can take 100 million pound plus a football player and uh, from different people and different sources uh, people saying uh, oh Arsenal can give uh, well, 100 million pound plus Declan, uh, no, sorry, 1 million pound for Declan Rice. They can give uh, West Ham 100 million pound plus Edin Ketia. But something that I, I didn't agree with because 100 million pound plus Edin Ketia, that's Edin Ketia is a very good football player, but he's valued at around 35 million pound. Uh, the Arsenal slapped a 35 million pound uh, on Edin Ketia. But when you see Edin Ketia, he's a very good football player, still young and talented. Uh, and that would take the transfer to something like 135 million pound you know so i would want to think that that's a bit extravagant that would be extreme and i would i think Arsenal shouldn't go for that but uh edin Ketty, i think personally i think he should remain at the club because he's a very good one and he's helped in a few occasions but the fact that Arsenal is going to be having uh kai Havis in there the fact that Arsenal is going to be having gabriel jesus quite a good number of forwards they're looking at offloading so i can sort of understand why they are pushing for his move away from the club but he's a very good one and i think he would uh, add something to the club Arsenal. edin Ketty is still young and talented he's got quite a big future ahead of him anyway let us know what you definitely think about this if Arsenal should go for this maybe possibly give uh, West Ham something like 90 million pound or 80 million pound plus Edin Ketia and that would still take if it's 80 it would still not make the 80, 90, 100, 110 something like that 80 plus Edin Ketia would it be it would, 100, it would be would it be quite good 80 million pound that would be a revised paper but west ham has made it clear the football player is valued at 120 million pound but they can take 100 pound 100 million pound plus a football player and the football player that is in uh this uh that, that we are definitely seeing is edin ketia because he's been linked to an exit of the club and a few sources are saying that he could be involved in this transfer anyway let us know what you definitely think and please subscribe and ring that notification bell thank you and goodbye for now